nothing off Lincoln. Not a goddamn word. I was on my own. <sighs> so it was clear that I was gonna have to look after myself. responsible for the incident that took place on the 28th of June, and it thereby finds you guilty as charged. I don't understand this, right? What do you want me to do? They're coming at me with a knife. It's self-defense, clearly, right? What do you want me to do? Let them stab me. Order. No, I'm telling you, right, there's people in this prison. They're out to get me. I need a transfer. I need it today. Your sentence is hereby extended by one year. Please, take the time alone to reconsider your life decisions. I'll consider the fact that you're a fucking punce. For what? Fucking defending yourself, that's for what? You fucking stupid cunts. Come on. You haven't got a fucking clue, have you? You sit there with your fucking, fucking stupid tie on. You haven't got a fucking clue. Nothing could have prepared me for the shit that I was about to go through in this hellhole. So I had to make a choice. If I was going to get through this stretch in one piece. Talking to me, mate, yeah? Talking to me, yeah? Then I was going to have to treat this like a fight. You fucking want it? Bum, bum. That's what I'm talking about, mate, yeah? Come back there and get some more! I had to change myself into something I didn't even recognise anymore. I'll fucking take all five of you! Bum, bum! Bum, bum, bum! Whoa! Fucking come on! As the months and the weeks rolled by, I slowly but surely turned myself into what you see before you now. A hardened, rusty nail. You see, the body can be strengthened to a degree, but it's your mind that makes you impervious to defeat. Just like the skin on your knuckles, the mind can be made callous as fuck. But only pain can do that. So I learn how to take pain, but more importantly, I learn how to dish it out. problem I had was why. Why did every fucker in that place want me dead? I mean, it didn't make any sense to me. I could work it out. And then one day, it all became clear. <laughs> Anyone else fucking want it? Anyone else? Huh? All right. Hey, that's it. In through the nose, out through the mouth. It's all right. Probably a bit concussed, mate. Wouldn't worry, the guards will land in a minute. Nothing personal, Kane, you know. Nothing personal. What's he doing then? Hey? What you got to gain from it other than a fucking skull frat show up? It was worth it, mate. It fucking would have been. 20 grand. We're talking about 20 grand. Well, what are you talking hey, about? 20 grand? Off. From where? Train was looking us up, yeah? I think your brother's bankrolling it. <laughs> what the fuck are you talking about? My brother? I ain't joking, eh? I only did it for the cash. My brother did this? You say your own fucking brother did this? My own brother? My own fucking brother? Why'd he do it, Hyde? 
I'm sorry, sweetheart. I've no idea what you're talking about. Don't you deny that. Don't you fucking dare. You might brother at a price tag put my head, didn't you? Dead I can accept it from a dirty, conniving little bastard like you, but I cannot accept that from him. Week after week, they came. One after another. Sometimes more than one. Do you know why it didn't matter to me? Keep them coming, I said. Bring on all comers. Come and have a fucking go, mate! The more that came, the stronger my mind got, and my daily existence became about survival. <laughs> possible to make your own napalm in prison, did ya? Well, you can. And it fucking burns. <laughs> We hereby find you guilty, and your sentence, Mr. Burgess, will be extended by two years. Five weeks segregation to commence post haste. Fuck you. dead inmate, and you had his blood on your clothes. Well, I'm adding an additional year to your sentence for being a part of the altercation. Likewise, six months segregation. 